Hi everyone, so I'm back to share another journal with you and this one is a fern and mushroom uh, themed uh, journal and it's made using a kit from Artie Mays. Uh, you can find Artie Mays linked below. Um, so I decided to make a little one. Uh, it's a hard fabric covered journal. It measures, um, let me see. Where's my notes? Okay, it measures six and a half by four and a half. It has a two and a quarter inch spine, has three signatures, 116 pages uh, front and back. And as you can see, it's kind of junky. Um, it will be listed on my shop if you're interested. So like I said, it's covered in this lovely fabric and I thought that would go nice. Um, like the, the green would go nice with the ferns in the kit. Uh, on the front here, I've got some lace trim down here. Make sure I'm in frame here. <clears throat> some lace trim. Then I've just got some layering here with some uh, digital paper from the kit. Uh, some vintage music paper. Then I made um, this little kind of clustery thing. Uh, this was using one of the journal cards. Uh, ticket, which is from one of Artie Mays' other kits. And this little um, embellishment from the kit. We've got eyelets and string as a closure. The middle signature is just pure, like for purely writing. Um, so it's just got coffee dyed paper in there. So do a little flip there. Okay. Um, we've got fabric on the inside here as well, on the spine. Um, this is one of the pages from the kit. And I will start doing the flip through. So, like I said, everything's from the kit. I don't think I've used anything. I might have used some um, some pages from the old design shop, but I think that's about it. So here I've made a little corner tuck, but it's got a little cluster on here using the tickets. A little ticket from the kit, and I've left that open so you can actually um, tuck something in behind that and the actual corner tuck, which I've just showed you. <laughs> uh, Sorry, I've got uh, just saw on my hands. Uh, tag from the kit. In fact, there's a few bits actually that might have been freebies. And if you go onto Artie Maze's, uh website, which is called artiemaze.com, you'll see the freebie page. So you can go on there and have a browse through that. So here's some little journaling cards and I've used the little tabs on the top. This is just coffee dyed uh, cardstock. These have all been backed onto coffee dyed paper as well. Uh, I think this is one of the freebies, uh, which is, uh, you get, I think it's two or three tags and something else with it, I can't remember. So if you watched my uh, Let's Make, which was yesterday or the day before, I can't remember, um, I made these journal cards using all the, all the bits are from Artie Mae. Some of it's not from the Fern and Mushroom, but um, it just went well together some of them like i said the freebies you can find them either on her website or on her facebook group so i've just done some edge punching this is some artie Maze's eco dyed papers the pockets from the kit the tag is from the kit oh this is a freebie as well and i think it's that away or is it that away that away. Um, some paper from the old design shop. This is um, a tag. I think this was a freebie paper as well. And I just printed that out um, on some like, lightweight cardstock. And then I backed it onto some more cardstock. Here's some sari ribbon there. And that just pops in there. Some lined paper. Another page from the kit. Another tag that I made. Uh, this is one of the pages from the kit and I just used that and cut it up to make these tags, the images from the kit and so is a little label. Lots of journaling room. This is another tag that I made um, on my Let's Make. And that's just paper clipped in. Another tag. Another pocket here. Little journal card there. A little tag. I think that might have been a freebie. Could be wrong, but I can't remember which ones are freebies and which ones weren't. This is just some coffee dyed, um, like a lightweight cardstock. I've just got some 
lined paper in there, a little booklet in one of the journal cards tops on the front. And that goes in there like so. Some more of the eco dyed papers. More journaling room. Here is a little, it's a pocket. I've got a pocket there as well. And the pocket there. Another little journal card that I made. It's just been stitched around the edge. And this is a little journal card and I just popped one of the tabs on the top of that as well. Little envelope. I think this was a freebie. And I just popped some of the... Is there something else in there? No. There's two little um, like uh, tea cards. and Or tea sized cards. I think that's what they're called. And a little ticket. And the envelope. It's got the lines on there. So you could actually journal on that as well. So that goes in there, and then we just have another fern uh, embellishment tag there, like so. And then this is the middle signature, which is just uh, all these pages to journal on, like so. And that's the front and that's the back. It's, uh, third signature, got another one of these, um, like a double pockets. And we have the tag, that's the freebie. Oops, didn't want to go in. Another little journal tag that I made. Another, again, I think that might be a freebie, but I'm not 100% sure. And a little ticket and a little fern card. And that goes in there, and that just sticks in there. That's just layered up there. Here we have um, an envelope. Inside the envelope is a journal card, and that's just paper clipped on there. And lots of journal room, another big tag is just paper clipped on there. Some uh, eco dyed paper from Artie Mays, another pocket from the kit, another little booklet that I made, just got lined paper in there, and that goes in there. Little tag, little fun journal card, some lined paper, another page from the kit. Again, these was these was <laughs> this is one of the things that I made um, on my Let's Make yesterday. The journal cards I made four in total. So you want to check out my playlist. There is, I think, there's about eighty odd videos on this, and they're all things that you can, you know, do. Um, within your journals and obviously you can do your own thing so that's that I enjoyed making them another little pocket we got a tag another journal card here it's all been stitched um, another tag that I made and this is another double corner tuck thing um, so that's opened behind there as well so this is a freebie that's from the kit love the mushrooms and here we just have another little tag that I made using one of the little cards from the kit a little fern card there and this is a little freebie so I'll just tuck that in there like so and that is the back so that is the journal so that was fun to do again it took me like three days to do this <laughs> i know a lot of people say oh it takes me like two weeks to do mine but if you know me you know i can knock the journals out big time but my back's just slowing me right down at the moment i'm still getting my little crafty time um which keeps me sane <laughs> so um yeah this will be listed in my shop um Artie Mays is list listed below as well um go over and check out her uh, etsy store go and check her website out for the freebies and also check out her facebook group as well so there we have it if you have any questions just ask and thank you for watching bye